And a very good afternoon to you. I'm Jennifer Sanders in for Christie. We begin with breaking news tonight. Appeal granted. Former Dr. Robert Newlander's murder conviction overturned by the state Supreme Court's appellate division in Rochester. Now, the four judge panel issuing its written decision about an hour ago. News Channel 9's Sydney Chalavo has been sifting through all of those papers. And Sydney, what can you tell us? So, Jennifer, this stack of papers means a new trial for the former doctor convicted in the 2012 murder of his wife, Leslie. This decision coming on the grounds of juror misconduct during his 2015 trial. Of the four points made by Newlander's newest attorney, Alexandra Shapiro, last October as to why the conviction should be overturned, it was the one dealing with juror misconduct that the panel agreed constituted the conviction be tossed out. Back in May of 2015, about a month after a jury found the former doctor guilty of killing his wife and trying to cover it up, it was juror 12 who found herself in the spotlight. She was publicly accused of misconduct after texting about the case with family and friends. Eventually, Onondaga County Judge Thomas Miller held a hearing on this issue, ruling a month later against Newlander's request to have his conviction overturned based on the actions of juror 12. The next step for the prosecution, the district attorney's office can appeal this decision to the state's highest court for the defense, likely a motion in county court to release Newlander while he awaits a new trial. Jennifer. All right, so thank you. Well, we are still waiting to hear back from the district attorney's office and from the defense to see when those actions may be taken. We'll, of course, keep you updated right here on News Channel 9 as well as localsyr.com.